Hey guys, how's it going? YouTube, we're gonna get back into some more Guitar Hero Live Festival Gallery content information. We're gonna be doing the Rock the Block Supergroup VIP party, what they have for information on Guitar Hero Live. Anyways, what they have, I don't know if I really doubt any of this information is correct. I'm sure it's all fabricated and just for the game, but we'll find out what Guitar Hero Live says about this super group for Rock the Block VIP party. Anyways, Rock the um, at Rock the Block, anything can happen. And with such an amazing lineup at this year's festival, the creation of its very own supergroup to play at the after party is a surprise to no one. With the lineup including rock legends Fight Hound and fresh talent from the ever popular Vivid Screams and Quantum Freaks, the group is a mega mix of the best music industry has to offer today. With security tight as at Cactus Joe's Cactus Joe's, there we go. The event is strictly VIP, so only a handful of fortunate fans will see Rock the Block history being made. Okay, we're going to go into the pictures now and see what information they have about the pictures. Anyways, Alex Moore is the lead vocals. After any supergroup needs a legendary frontman, and Alex Moore from Fight Hound is about a, as legendary as they may get. He may have had an interesting career, but he is what music is all about, and his personality and confidence are ideal for leading a band of this much talent. You know, it, it reminds me of how um, Scott Whalen died recently of Stone Temple Pilots because he was in the super group, which was um, Velvet Revolver, and he died recently of, I'm pretty sure it's not confirmed 100%, but it sounds like it was a cocaine overdose, which is pretty sad, but I don't know. I, I kind of expected it. I thought that he would have died a while ago, um, and he did live till he was about 48, and for a rock star that stayed a rock star, that's a pretty long life. Still is sad to me, because he made some really awesome music, and he was a pretty damn good singer. Anyways, we're going to go into the next picture. Rick Carr is the guitarist. Rick Carr from Quantum Freaks is the perfect fit for the supergroup because not only is he a part of one of the fastest up-and-coming bands today, but he has a musical diversity like no other. No matter what tracks this group want to perform, you can guarantee he'll be able to play along on another or on an instrument. Next, Kitty Harvey is the bassist. If there's going to be a supergroup, it has to be to feature somebody from one of the biggest bands to break out in the past few years, Kitty Harvey from Vivid Screams is not only an excellent musician, she brings her um, brings with her a musical pedigree to add even more talent to the group. Next, Jimmy Romero is the drummer. Um, any band can have a drummer, but the supergroup have the best around. Not only are not content with being one in one band, Jimmy Romero from Fight Hound has played with more than seven groups during his career and with energy and enthusiasm can only bring another level to his this collection of talented musicians. And the next picture is the supergroup Band Central. With the crowd strictly VIP for the supergroup's performance, several other bands have been spotted at the Cactus Joe's venue, Joseph's venue. Is that how it's supposed to be said? I'm not sure. I don't think that's right. With the festival season coming to a close, it seems as though many are losing, are using the after party to bring their busy festival touring schedules to an end for another year. And the very last, oh yeah, I got a video coming too. Um, the last picture is the supergroup, the legend of the supergroup. It's not the first rock the block where there have been rumors of a supergroup performing. At last year's festival, several bands were planning to perform together, but a busy touring schedule meant many had to leave early. Luckily, though, for those at the VIP party this year, the festival lineup has managed to stay a little longer to make rock the block history. 
in the video for you. I don't know what song is going to play. I'm not going to go ahead and play it, but you get to see the pictures and it sounds like it's going to be the Rolling Stones playing in this video, but I'm not going to play it. We're just going to look through the pictures and you get to see them and we'll see if there's any really cool ones. There's some okay pictures it looks like. And these are all like, you know, fake pictures or whatnot from the game, but some of them are kind of cool. Guitars and vocals and the super group VIP party. Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed that one. I will be continuing on with the um, information from the festival gallery for you and the pictures and etc. Um, I'm going to be finishing up tonight the last one and then I'll call that good enough for now and then I'll be recording more shortly. Anyways, please thumbs up, share, comment, subscribe. Lots and lots more to come on Guitar Hero Live and many other music games. Bye for now.